corner. Mayhap, if I hang about, someone will buy There's a waste of time. No one does. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me anytime. Always a pleasure. I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle by way of sound strategy and defensive tactics. Not compares to a real bow. No, a treasure chest. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? I ought to be getting home. We're running low on everything. From provisions to crafting materials for weapons and armor. Oh, we've had a hard time procuring goods, what with all the monsters lurking on the roads of late. I sent Marcus to gather what we need, but I've just taken stock and I fear the list I gave him was incomplete. What say you? Could I trouble you to run an errand for me? <laughs> You'd be paid, of course. I'm glad to hear it. Here, take this list of additional supplies to Marcus. He ought to be somewhere north of here. Hand him the note and he'll take care of the rest. Beg pardon, sir, but I'm on duty at present. Light. Shopping is such fun. The longer the journey, the more supplies we'll require. That's just what I was thinking. My patience okay. wears a little thinner little each rest. passing year. My bed goods. Have a gander at my wares. You shan't regret it. Hope to see you again here long. See that? Orc catches the light. We ought to take a closer look. Hey, oh, you a soldier? Could be a surprise to see you arrive in one piece if not. 
Hordes of monsters have been plaguing this area of late, you see. We've had to start sending out new recruits to cull them. Is that so? Who went yonder? Lachlan. But I dare say he'll fare all right. Aye, I expect he will. Who was sent out that way, then? Accardo. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried for him. What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? The lad can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Fie! I want to go to his aid, but we can't just abandon our posts. Say, you seem stout of heart. Would you be willing to go in our stead? It isn't far, only a short ways out from the main gate. You've my thanks. Anacardos as well, I'm sure. A rescue mission, is it? And I dare say time is of the essence. Putting that aside, we've not counted a thief among our number for some time. Thieves aren't as dastardly as they sound. I'm sure you'd find them. We've got goblins! Shame I've never advantage of the foe. Are we all in the same boat? You won't need a team. Allow me. Wait right there. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way? I could make that shot. You have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I... I was paralyzed. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. I'll have to train harder, till I have the confidence to face such beasts on my own. Well, I'd best be heading back, but I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. I hope we meet again someday. Don't we have a report to make, Master? And here I was, hoping for some great treasure. Now I feel a fool. We cannot expect gleaming treasures round every corner.
come to think of it, the private quarters of one Arisen I served had many a visitor, and rarely the same one. Each to their own. Once more! Wait to find out what's inside. Pressed on, wouldn't you say, Master? I'll gather this. It might be of use. Hail, friend. Many thanks for aiding Ocado. Twas a relief to see him return, and none the worse for wear. Aye, that it was. The poor sod might not have made it back alive had you not intervened. Twas a bit too early for him to be seeing actual combat. That much was made well clear. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here are well known for whipping recruits into shape with their grueling regimes. <laughs> Speaking of training regimes, I must admit I've half a mind to ask you to join us. We could use someone with your experience. So well now there's a worthy prize. If only it weren't so far away.
I'm dead on my feet. <laughs> Be nice nice be kind to work Fancy a gander? Oh, I find goods for sale. Well met. Much obliged. It takes two to make a sale, and this seller had nothing to tempt us with. Funds are better spent elsewhere. The Arisen is ever prudent in the application of coin. You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. We have found the material. Different combinations of materials result in different creations. That's everything assembled. A job well done if I do say so myself. Oi! Did you need something? This is from Sir Geoffrey, is it? Let's have a look then. Why? He wants these as well, does he? I thought I was finished. Why should I have to do all this on my own? I've got plenty to carry as teeth. Say, your arms look free. You can handle that list in my stead. And make haste. I would depart for the encampment even a moment sooner. Well, go on. You know what to do. I'll not find anything if we don't start looking. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. No harm in picking a few. Think of it, we're all of differing vocations, aren't we? Our respective abilities are unique as well. Yeah, at the end of the day, our vocations are of little import. Mutual trust is what counts.
Our results are awaited. What say we make our report? How goes it? Have you gathered everything on the list yet? Haven't you anything for me yet? Well, you best get to it then. Here you are, Master. How goes it? Have you gathered everything on the list yet? Brilliant! I knew I could count on you. Here, take this for your trouble. I'll be heading back to the encampment now. They'll be expecting me. We'd best report back. Oi, many thanks for passing on that list to Marcus for me. As I hear it, you even assisted him in gathering the supplies. <laughs> I hope it wasn't too much trouble. Anyway, you've been a great help. I hope I can count on your aid again should the need arise. Our efforts have seen the encampment resupplied, and Sir Geoffrey with one less care. A good deed all round. Well said. Is a chest! Let us hope your curiosity will be rewarded. If your plane had arisen in search of preferable treatment, you'll be sorry. Your head is like to roll ere long. So well every day. I'm sorry. I'm nodding off there, I Pray slow your feet! You run too fast for the likes of me! Let us endeavour to keep up, though we are less fleet of foot. I'll harvest what I can, should it please you.
Look, master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. While traveling beyond the rift, I uncovered a treasure chest hidden in this very locale. Shall we seek it out? The find of the century, I dare say. I wonder whether my master from beyond the rift managed to find that. Somehow I doubt it. The ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? so soon? Why, oh, we seem to have come through unscathed. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be in our favor. Try not to get hit!
It is no more or less than what one might have expected. Say no to a short repose hereabouts. It would be a good place to take stock of our surroundings. That's just what I was thinking. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat thrills to gathering items. I am confident and may act independently. Let us work together to honor the Arisen's trust. If you seek to restore your memories, Master, me thinks a trip to Malv might be just the thing. I can guide you there if you wish. A guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. Fond of picking things up, aren't you? You are in need. I must serve. Of the village. Tis a sorry sight indeed. The dragon truly is calamity incarnate.
Well met. Go on, have a gander as you pass by. Pleasure doing business with you. Nothing caught your eye? That's a shame. Let's hope there's aught worth our coin next time. Browsing was enough to scratch the itch in my... Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. Second time I've watched over you like this, isn't it? You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? 
You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. Twas terrible. I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. But you hung on and by some miracle survived. Arisen, I'm afraid I don't understand your meaning. Does it have aught to do with why you were taken to the castle? They said twas so that your wounds could be treated, though I fear you have no memory of this either. I am of the Border Watch. Someone with Arisen-like abilities came to this village horn in tow. Know you all of this? Has he come for you? We are to part so soon then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Till then, take care. Everson. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. I'm glad I found you. The ruler of Vermont, currently convalescing in the capital, became arisen here in this very village. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? If you truly are arisen, you will be received with open arms. Oh, but forgive me, I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Lennart was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Last I saw, he was having a drink at the inn. What say we gather some information? Here to ask all of me, are you? Prod me if you must, Master, but I've nothing more to say. Proud to have served Arisen. I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle by way of sound strategy and defensive will be an honor to serve. There's a ladder here. We ought to put it to good use.
Well, you ought not strain yourself, not in your current state. Those burns could easily have killed you outright. I expect it will be some time before you fully recover. A solitary shard is good for little. We need to seek out more of these if tis to be of use. We ought to keep it with care, lest we lose it. Have you some business with the apothecary, sir? Dreadful sorry if I was in your way. Oh, no. I'm not lost or not, sir. You needn't worry yourself on my account. I'm an apothecary in training, you see. My family runs a little shop in Vernworth. So when I heard tell of a medicine only to be found in this village, I thought I'd come and fetch some for us. Made the journey all by myself as well, if you can believe it. But, well, as luck would have it, I've not enough gold for the medicine. It will be a shame to return empty-handed after coming all this way. But what more can I do? What? You'd do that? You'd get the medicine for me? suppose there's no harm in that. If you're really sure... Oh, sir, I'd be most grateful. Seems my luck's not as rotten as I'd thought. I'll wait right here for your return, sir. And many thanks for your kindness. We could make the fruit robberant ourselves, or simply purchase some at Runa's Apothecary here in Mel. At last, it all becomes clear. Ah, well met. Here for some fruit robberant, are we? Always a pleasure. What say we see this delivered? These writings. Hello again, sir. Say, have you brought some fruit robberant for me? Oh, so this is what it looks like. Brilliant. Many thanks, sir. I haven't much to offer in return, but I'll be sure to tell Grandfather what you did for us. He'll want to reward you proper like, I'll bet. One could not have hoped for a gladder outcome. My hat is time away looking. Well met. You're the one who saved Ulrika's life, aren't you? 
She told me all about it. It was a very brave thing you did. I'm in your debt. Ulrika's as good as my daughter. Here, consider this a small token of my gratitude. Now, tell me, are you registered with a guild? Perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild will grant you access to specialized training, which comes in very useful when pursuing a vocation. Well now, that won't do. You need only speak with the innkeeper to register. Go on, it will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vacations, mayhap I can advise you. Tis a vacation for those who seek to master the sword and shield. Fighters favor a balanced approach, excelling in both offense and defense, and can adapt to any situation. I am a fighter myself, and should there come a time when you impress me with your prowess, I might be willing to impart unto you some of what I know. Should you dedicate yourself to a vocation, you will find that new paths to master will open up to you over time. Try them as you like. Very well. There is no wrong choice in any case. It is entirely up to you which vocation you adopt. But I shan't take up any more of your time. Pray be well. What are you doing? Here at the inn, we also offer changes of vocation for those who seek it. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me. Did you need something? We must rest, though the sun is still up. I return safe and sound, and I dare say wiser for my travels. Now we've the vim to tackle the day ahead. Off we go then. Feeling rested, I trust. <laughs> 